December 2023, an eruption in the Sundunka crater field of the Reckonis Peninsula shocked the world. This volcano erupted right to a geothermal uh, power plant, one of the first in the world. And in January 2024, a second eruption burned parts of the town of the Grindavik. But if it was not for the expertise and the designs of two wonderful daughters of Iceland, this would have been a disaster. That design was for the Fagradesville eruption, and they did it here again. And a flotilla of the machinery and contractors implemented their plans, built the wall around the Swartzengi power plant and to the north of the uh, town of the Grindavik. And when the day of the eruption happened, this is what happened. We had the fissure coming from the north in the Hagerfell toward the town, opening up the ground in real time, slicing through part of the wall even. But the miracle of the wall stopped the spread of the lava. The lava followed the counter of the wall that these contractors in real time were actually working again on it and stopped it at the point. The solidified part of the lava formed another wall. Based on that and inspired by that, I uh, figured out where it may be the next eruption. In this area we are going for that now at the moment and uh, I suggested that the north of the Hagerfall will this time witness the eruption and it's quite possible a tongue of the lava from the east of the Grindavik will flow toward the peninsula to the north top of this image and here we are we have now the designs for a new wall toward the east of the Grindavik. This is the SAR images from the German uh, Space Agency. You can see that. A new defensive wall to the east where the lava flow potentially will flow from that toward the sea from the north of the Hagerfall, following the counter of the ground, will protect the Grindavik. You can see their design from the space. And every tourist who enters the aerospace of the Iceland over the peninsula, we'll see that also. A new wall will be added to that to protect the town.